So the first question today is, as a gynecologist, do we need to learn cystoscopy? And the answer is yes. And the indications are many. The first and foremost indication of cystoscopy for a gynecologist is while you are suspecting a bladder or ureteric trauma or want to check the integrity while doing a gynecological surgery. It can be combined with cervical biopsy setting to stage the disease rather than sending your patient just for the cystoscopy to a urologist. Diagnosis and treatment of bladder pain syndrome can be done. Cystoscopy is mandatory following a TVT retropubic taping and also after uterosacral ligament suspension. Bladder Botox is a simple and effective procedure for urge incontinence and it is done cystoscopically. Cystoscopy is also required in cases of suspected mesh erosion. We perform cystoscopy with our simple office hysteroscope. Here, we enter through the urethra into the bladder. This is the urethric orifice and now wait for the magic. Can you appreciate the peristalsis of the ureter? And see this spurt of urine. This indicates the patency of the ureter. This is the trigone, the difference in color and texture can be beautifully appreciated here. In cases of difficulty of visualization of ureter, the ureteric bulge can be traced to the ureteric orifice. This is the transmitted movement of the bladder wall while moving the TVT which is already in place.
here are some important tips for you. Don't forget to give two tablets of pyridium the night before to the patient. In case if ureteric orifices are not visualized, consider removing some of the distension media and try to see again. If you are lost, try to locate the distinct gas bubble at the fundus first.